Welcome to Channel AMAC, your insight to the Australian visa system. Good day everyone, my name is Carl Young, your online YouTube visa consultant. Are you interested in migrating to Australia? Why don't you consider to subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell on the side so once by all the updates and news, you'll be the first one getting all the insight. Alright, uh, today's video, we will um, give a little of a glimpse on what's happening with the international education industry, which a lot of people seem to uh, have a lot of concern with. Now, recently there has been more updates uh, from the government and from the industry as well. It's chaotic. It's just crazy. A lot of people has actually lost hope and I still thanks and appreciate it for all the viewers even you have lost the hope for Australia but you're still watching my channel I'll give you a lot of thumbs up on that one anyway keep it up I think there were still good dreams good Australian dreams to go but for the recent few years probably will be pretty hectic all right let's uh, just jump into the first uh, news media that that's came out uh, when was that that was yesterday so ACU Australian Catholic University now what's happening uh, as the uh, topic reads is says the ACU propose cap allocation already full well, and they're not talking about 2024 that's this year they're talking about 2025 what the uh, are they are they lo have they lost their mind uh, now this is the problem with the uh, cap allocations if they want to put a cap on the quarter then obviously I think what ACU is trying to say is look you know just don't bluntly send me send us all the uh, you know admission applications we are here to choose. We want to choose the best one because we only got this many that we can accept for 2025. So the, the letter has been a review. It says, Dear Valley Partners, thank you for your continued support at Australian Catholic University. ACU welcomes students for all cultures and faith. Yeah, well, well what about the, uh, the genuine student tests? Sometimes for the country with risk level higher whether they're cultural or faith well they still get refusals we we have seen a lot of those ones haven't we we recognize the value important in contributing to national students make our campus as well as uh, wider Australian community regrettably uh, due to a recent policy update that's the caps on the allocations the national plan level being implemented by the Australian government the high demand of ACU program have reached the limit well, does it mean that have already accept all the international student for 2020 or perhaps they just closed it now they are basically saying that they are talking about they believe that the national planning level which means the capital international student will go ahead despite there's a senate hearing and things like that and still a lot of people yelling and complaining uh, don't know what's gonna happen so that's the agent update there i'm not gonna go through in detail there so uh unfortunately <laughs> i don't know uh, <clears throat> uh can you still submit uh, a student application to acu <laughs> from what they have announced probably not uh, but i think it's more of the quarter control for the year of 2025 it's just weird i mean uh, we've been in the industry for 20 years it's a commercialized a free you know trading industry and now it's been restricted now i've been talking to a lot of my australian friends uh we just saw another news another builder collapse bankrupt you know going down going under uh why wouldn't the government help them out because if they help them out <clears throat> they can come up and build more house they saw out the housing crisis isn't it how is our minister of housing miss claire o'neill is doing don't know well uh, there's that being in some announcement that but can you sort it out in next month or before 2025 no it's been a long-term issue already so it's not just the uh, international students issue or the migrants anyway it's been um chaotic again in another arena now the um, other schools and colleges is throwing out some crazy stuff 
uh, from the Quran News that's also reported yesterday. Sky High Agent Commission, a high a sign of panic. <coughs> so basically, due to the general student tests uh, and the mass number of refusals, plus the cap allocation on international students. So some of the school is throwing out money just to want to keep their business operational. By doubt, by the end of the year, I think a lot of them of course, the private institution will go under as well, just like those builders. So they are not just killing the housing industry; they are also killing the international education industry. So some of them is offering hundred percent commission on course deposit. Now, not the course fees for the deposit. So all the deposit that the student made, they give it hundred percent out. Back to the agent, just to get the agent to do the nasty works. Now I'm not gonna do that because I know even if you pay the deposit, it's not gonna return, and also you probably get a visa refusal as well. Fifty percent on transfer on short students. So asking the student already in Australia, look, just to change your course, to change your school institution, thirty, forty, forty-five percent commission per student bonus, two thousand dollar marketing incentive enrollments, two thousand dollar special bonus, and so on and so forth. So the colleges are in a panic mode. Uh, it's crazy. So if you have watched and viewed this video, please tell your friend. No, don't go there. And I show you the fact. And this is straight away I've received in our email. As you can see, you know, if you we they they only accept one thousand five hundred dollars, and they will provide a COE forty percent scholarship. Look at that. This is just throwing out. Are they making money? Probably not. They just wanted to. Keep themselves operational. They don't want it to go under, just like a lot of other builders there. So, what do you say? Probably leave your comment right down below. I see you next video. Goodbye.